Hey, what's up, guys? Boy, why do I do think I'm out today? Thank you guys for all the support. Lately. It's been greatly appreciated. Um, today, we have an absolute great video for you guys. We're going to show you guys how to get the brand new 92 overall team standout card for absolutely free. Doesn't cost any coins, not even one single coin. Uh, so, if you guys want to stay tuned for that method, if you guys have been to the channel, Remember that subscribing is free and it helps me out greatly. So if you guys could smash that bell notification and subscribe down below, millisecond that I'll take. Um, let's grind to the video. So I'll show you guys how to do it. It's very simple. This method is going to take less than like a minute to do. Well, for me to explain it, but not a minute to do. It's going to take about an hour to do, but it's going to be worth it at the end. Um, so if you guys have already completed all these Team Diamond Series 1, Team Diamond uh, standout series two and then team standout series three okay it says play through a highlight moment from each team's standout player complete all 32 challenges to earn your choice of a nat of a 92 overall standout player nat to add to your team i don't know if it gives you the power up but i know it gives you the 92 overall and these souls aren't that difficult all you have to do is score three russian touchdowns which you can do Fairly easy, easily. I don't think you have to do on all three stars unless you want the coins. Uh, get five pass completions, which is very easy. Pass for 25 yards. Complete 11 passes. You can do that one drive. Just do drags. Pass for 113 yards. Uh, it doesn't say you aren't allowed to give them a touchdown, so I'd go in field goal block once you guys get your first touchdown and pass for like 100 yards or like 90 yards in your first one because you're actually 75 yards because you start at the 25 yard line and then once you guys like play defense go to a field goal block let them score and then just get the ball back throw a touch or long pass and that's pretty much it that one will probably take you at least at the max like four or five minutes um get four tackles very easy but once you guys complete all these you will get a 92 overall, and the cards are looking really good. Well, not as good as the last time, but these cards are looking pretty good for you if you guys are doing theme teams. Especially if you guys are doing theme teams. If you're just doing normal, these cards aren't that great. But I'm happy because Jerry Greenlaw got a card today. Same with Jordan Hicks, so I'm going to add them to my team as soon as possible. I still have no coins because I just bought Aaron Rodgers. I'm about to do a gameplay on him, so stay tuned for that. Um, so let's check out the standouts cards. Well, let's go to team standouts. Where is it? Team standouts. And then you get a 92 overall. I was not expecting these cards to be 92 overall. I thought that for sure they're going to be like 91. But there's a lot of good cards. Brandon Scarlet for the Texans. Um, these cards are looking alright. You got 87 speed, 91 acceleration, 83 strength, 91 tackling, 90 play rack, 88 block chain, 77 power move, 61 finesse move. This card doesn't look that great, but it's it is what it is. Um, Jared Goff. So if you guys are Ram Steam team, this is great for you guys. 78 speed. He'll get up to like 83 speed if you guys get a full theme team of the Rams. 93 power throw power, which you get up to 99 throw power because of the plus one from the power up. And then the plus five from go deep or play fake. Um, if you guys run in those chemistries. 91 short accuracy, 88 mid accuracy, 86 deep accuracy, 85 throw under pressure, which is not that great. 88 throw on the run, 89 play action. I would rank this card like a five out of ten. It's not that great, but it's if it's gonna be better if you guys put it on a theme team. But he only gets one team chemistry because he's only been in the league for like a short time. Um, I think there's a couple good, like, cornerbacks and receivers. I think Tim Patrick is one of them. I don't know for sure, but we can look at his stats. He's got 91 speed. He put on the Denver Broncos team team. He's got 96 speed. Just pretty fast. Not as fast as Tyreek Hill, but, like, one speed lower. If you guys put on Broncos team team. Even if you guys don't, you still have 94 speed around there. 89 jumping, 90 catching, 90 catching traffic, 91 spec catch, 87 short running, 87 mid running, 88 deep running. So if you guys get deep, uh, go deep on him, he'll have the deep uh, route running threshold and I believe mid and short. I don't know for sure, so double check on that. But this card's looking pretty good. He's 210, 6'4", six, six, so he's going to be able to catch some, like, 
Moss Balls type, like Calvin Johnson. Um, but there's another cornerback right here that looks fair, fairly good. Uh, Carlton Davis the third. 91 speed, looking pretty good. 92 acceleration, 88 agility, 87 inch jumping, 90 play rack, 91 man coverage, which if you get that boosted up with lockdown uh, 50 out of 50, get plus 5, power him up, 97 man coverage, um, of 94 zone coverage, 97 press. This card's going to look fairly good if you guys put it on a Buccaneers theme team especially. Uh, so, all these cards are helping out your theme teams. Nothing else, really. If you guys aren't running a theme team, you're kind of you're kinda screwed. Not going to lie. So, yeah. And then, I don't understand. Actually, I predicted Brian Poole. I predicted him. A, a lot of my predictions actually came true. So, I'm kind of happy about that. But, if you guys somehow have a Jets theme team on 96 speed, 92 acceleration, 87 uh, agility, 84 jumping, 92 play rack, 95 man coverage with plus uh, 5 man coverage and zone coverage and press. Uh, so I have 94 zone coverage, 93 press. This card's looking pretty good. Um, he's good all around the board. Uh, but uh, I don't really know if this card's good. I'm thinking he is, but I don't know. No, he's not. Alright, good to know. 88 speed. No, no, I'm good. Uh, so that kind of sucks. They should have gave him faster, more speed than that, but they didn't. They said, nah, you're slow. There you go. Give you 88 speed. Um, My boy MVS got a card. Let's look at his stats real quick. He'll have 97 speed on a full Packers team, team which is tied with Tyreek Hill for the fastest receiver in the game. Um, 82 jumping, 92 catching, not. 90 or 89 catching traffic, 89 spec catch, 85 short running, 89 better running, 92 uh, deeper running. So he's going to get all three thresholds, actually two thresholds because short running. But if you guys get him, I believe play fake or any of those kind of chemistry, so he'll be able to get up to 90, which is the threshold this year. So look on for that. If you guys want MVS, maybe you guys are running a Packers team team. But these cars are looking decent. I wouldn't say they're great, uh, but the Cowboys got a lot of good upgrades. They got Cole Beasley and, uh, what's that other guy's name? Cole Beasley. Was it Trayvon? I think it was Trayvon Diggs. Oh, no, I shoot, I picked the wrong team. But anyway, we can look at the Cardinals, because that's my theme team, my half and half theme team. If you guys are thinking about doing half and half, if anything, team, do it. It's worth it. Especially if you're doing Cardinals and uh, the 49ers. It's it's extremely worth it. This card's going to look absolutely insane on my team. I can't wait to pick him up. Same with Dre Greenlaw. You can look at his stats and then we go to Trayvon Diggs to final, to final it out. Um, Dre Greenlaw finally got a card. I'm glad that he finally got a card. Um, he'll have... 90 speed on my theme team, uh, 89 acceleration, 74 strength, 93 tackling, 91 play rack. He's more of a zone coverage player. He's 85 block shedding, 56 power move, and 63 finesse move. Overall, looking pretty good. He's a six foot user. Uh, nothing too special, but he is looking fairly good. Uh, and then let's go to the Cowboys. Because why not? Let's check out Chavon Diggs. He's going for 180,000 coins right now. His car's looking pretty good, honestly. 91 speed, which could get boosted up to 96. 91 acceleration. Um, 90 agility. 91 jumping. 90 play rec. 96 man coverage if you guys get 50 out of 50. Um, and then 93 zone coverage and 96 press. And he's 6'1". This is a really good upgrade for your Cowboys theme teams. Even though I don't really like the Cowboys that much because I'm a big Packers fan. But, yeah. So, uh, that's all I'm going to say about the Cowboys. But there's a lot of good cards. So, if you guys are thinking about picking them up. Um, and if you guys have the coins, then pick them up. Especially if you guys are rocking a the theme team. But if you guys enjoyed this video, please remember to subscribe down below. Take that millisecond. Smash that bell notification to get notified when a video comes out live. And remember, subscribing is free, so that would help me out a lot. 
and to his liking the video. Um, see you guys next video. Peace out. Love you guys.